Hi, I'm Miss Khalid and I'm here to talk to you about some of my favorite books as well as the importance of dialogue in a book. So some of the books that I enjoy reading are picture books that have great illustrations to them. And one of the books that I really enjoy reading with students is The Day That Crayons Quit by Drew Daywalt. Um, I love this book so much because the characters in the book, the crayons, they truly express their emotions when they're writing letters to Duncan, which is another character in the book. So I'm going to read to you um, a letter that Purple Crayon wrote to Duncan. Dear Duncan, all right, listen, I love that I'm your favorite crayon for grapes, dragons, and wizard's hats, but it makes me crazy that so much of my gorgeous color goes outside the lines. If you don't start coloring inside the lines soon, I'm going to completely lose it. Your very neat friend, Purple Crayon. So you can see from that book um, that if you attend to the punctuation, you can truly see the emotions that are coming out. And also, if you see the dialogue in there too, you can and you pay attention to how the character truly is feeling, you'll see what the emotions that the author is trying to convey with that particular character. <clears throat> Another book that I enjoy reading with students is First Day Jitters and is by Julie, Julie Danenberg. And I love this book because it has a interesting twist to the end of the book and the illustrations show, um, it, it gives a great uh, detail to how the characters are in the book. And then if you pay attention to the dialogue, it truly expresses the, expresses the emotions of the characters as well. So I'm gonna read a couple of pages from this book too. What will everyone think if you aren't there? We told them that you were coming. They will think that I'm lucky, and they'll wish that they were at home in bed, just like me. Mr. Hartwell sighed. <sighs> Sarah Jane Hartwell, I'm not playing this silly game one second longer. I'll see you in downstairs in five minutes. So as you can see, the emotions of the characters were conveyed by the illustrations, and also if you paid attention to the dialogue and you took importance to it, you could see how um, expressive the characters are in the story. So um, just remember, read, 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 and readers are leaders, and leaders are readers.